26, 2021. So for us to start with our review, let's count from 1 to 50. You have to count with teacher, okay? Let's start with the number 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Did you count with me? Very good. Now it's time for us to complete the numbers 1 to 50, okay? So we have to write the missing numbers. So we have 1, 2, 3, and 4. Let's write number 4 there. Okay, teacher will change her marker so you can see it clearly there. Number 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Let's continue. 5. Then we have number 6. 7. And then the number 8. Yes. 8, 9, 10. And the next one is number 11. Very good. That's 1 and 1. That's 11. Let's continue counting. 10, 11, 12. That is 1 and 2, 12, 13, 14, 15, 6, 16. That's 1 and 6 together. We have the number 16. Let's continue. 15, 16, 17. 1 and 7, 17. 18, 19. 19 is 1 and the number 9. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 2 and 3 or 2 and 2? Two? 2 and 2. Okay, we still have some more. Let's go back to 20, okay? 20, 21, 22, 23. That's 2 and 3. 23. After 23, 22, 23, 20. Four. That's two and four. Okay, let's continue. 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. That's two and eight. 28, 29. Two and nine together for 29. Let's continue counting. 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, that's 3 and 2, 33, 34 is 3 and 4, very good, 34, 35, 3 and 5, 35, 36, 3 and the number 6, 37, 38, 3, and the number 8, 38, 39, 40, 4, and 0, 40, 40, 41, 4, and 1, 41, 42, 43, 4, and 3, 44, 45, 4, and 5, 46, 46, 47, 48, 49, and lastly, we have 50, that is 5 and 0. So let's check if it's all correct. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. We completed all of the missing numbers. <coughs> so now let's proceed to our number friend for today. And that is the number number seven so we have number seven here and we have to look for the number seven flowers so number seven looks like this going line to the side and slanting line down so that's what seven looks like so okay i found one number seven here another number seven i have this one and this one so we found all of the number sevens now let's proceed to sorting the pictures that show seven. So we always remember to mark and count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That so shows seven, so it should be here on the tree. Now let's count the cubes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope, that's eight. It should be here in the bottom. Now, let's count the dots on the dice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. Seven. So, it should be here on top, not in the bottom. Okay, here, this is a number word. S-E-V-E-N. Seven. Seven. So, that should be here on top. Uh oh What happened? Okay, let's move that one here on top. Next one, we have this number. This is the number 7, so it should be here on top also. Now, let's count our smiley faces or your happy faces. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 happy faces. That's not 7, so it should be here in the bottom part. Now, the dots inside our bus. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Seven, eight, eight. Nope, it should be in the bottom also. And the last picture that we have, let's count the tally markers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, that shows seven. So that should be here on top to complete our tree. What number is this again? Number seven. Very nice. Now that we're done with seven, the next number will be the number number eight okay so number eight looks like that so number eight is this one is this number eight nope that's three this one oh that's four okay here there's number eight here on top this is one okay i have eight here in the bottom part so we found all of the number eights. Now let's sort the pictures to complete our tree. We have the word E I G H T that reads eight. So we should put it here on the tree. Okay, here I have one and eight together. One and eight, that's 18. So it should be in the bottom because we're only having number eight. Okay, here are the dots on the bus. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Seven, eight on the bus will be here on top. Okay, now let's go to our happy face or our smiley face. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's eight, so that should be on top also. This number that doesn't show 8, that's number 7. Just like our number a while ago. Now the dots on our domain, on our dice, I mean. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 
six, seven, eight, eight dots should be on the tree. Now let's count the fingers on the hand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's eight fingers up. Let's put it on our tree. And then the last one, our boxes or our cubes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, that's one more than eight. That's nine. So it should be in the bottom. So we already completed our number eight and our number seven tree. So now it's your turn to work, okay? You also have to sort number seven and number eight there with you. You can pause the video so you can finish your work. Okie dokie, time for our letters. Let's review our alphabets and their letter sounds. So we have the letter A. The sound of A is A for alligator. We have letter B. The sound of B is B for bear. Letter C. The sound of C is K, K for cat. Letter D. The sound of D is D. D, D for dog. Letter E. The sound of E is E. E, e for elephant. Letter F. The sound of F is F. For frog, letter G, the sound of G is G for goat, letter H, the sound of H is H for hippo, letter I, the sound of I is I for iguana, letter J, the sound of J is J for jelly beans, letter K, the sound of K is K for kangaroo, Letter L, the sound of L is L for lobster. Letter M, the sound of M is M for monkey. Letter N, the sound of N is N for nest. All done with the letters A to the letter N. We still have some more. So we have letter O, the sound of O is O for owl. Letter P, the sound of P is P for penguin. Letter Q, the sound of Q is Q for quilt. Letter R, the sound of R is R for raccoon. Letter S, the sound of S is for snake. Letter T, the sound of T is T for turtle. Letter U, the sound of U is A for umbrella. Letter V, the sound of V is V for vulture. Letter W, the sound of W is W for whale. Letter X, the sound of X is X for x-ray. Letter Y, the sound of Y is Y for yak. And lastly, letter Z, the sound of Z is Z for zebra. Now that we're done with our letters, now let's remember how to write them. We have the letter M. M starts at the top with a straight line down. Then the top go down, up, down like a silly little frown. So let's try that with our marker. So it says start at the top, we make a straight line down. Then we go back at the top, we go down, up, and a straight line down again. Okay, so we made our capital letter M. Let's do that one again. Start at the top, we go down, go back up, slanting line down, go up, and a straight line down again. So I want you to practice also, huh? You write on your whiteboard, just like what teacher Sarah is doing. Start at the top, we go down, back to the top, slide down, climb up, Line down again. We have letter M. Now it's time for us to have our letter sounds. Okay, sorry, pictures pala that begins with the letter M. So M is for m -m money. M for m -m rat. Nope. That's the letter R for rat. How about letter M? M -m for mushroom, mushroom. How about yak, yak, 
No, that's letter Y for yak. So let's write letter Y. Okay, here. This is a wand. Wook, wook, wand. So that's one. So if that's one, this should be a mouse, okay? Sorry, the rat pala is the big one. This one is a small one. So this is a mouse, okay? So let's cover the mouse. And this one, this, this is one. So it should be letter W. And the last picture that we have is the yo-yo. That's for the letter Y. So let's review again, okay? Letter M is for money, mouse, and mushroom. Now, let's go to the next letter, which is the letter N. N. N starts with a line going straight to the ground, slant a line, and go up. There's no messing around. So, let's try that one. So, we start at the top, we make a straight line down, we go back to the top, we make a slanting line down, and then we go back up, okay? Let's do that one right on your boards. Straight line down, go back to the top, slanting line down, and go back up again. One more straight line down, go back to the top, slanting line, and then we make a line going up again. We have capital letter N. Now, let's proceed to our next picture, next beginning sound, I mean. So, N is for boat. Hmm, nope, that's not the N sound. So, let's make letter, bright letter B, I mean, because that's B for boat. And then here, night time. Night time. Night time begins with the letter N, so let's cover that. This one is a king. King does not begin with the letter N. It's the letter K. And here, this one, this is small, remember? So, if it's small, it's a mouse. So, that's letter M mouse okay and then we have a necklace necklace we put that around our neck necklace begins with the letter n and lastly this is the newspaper newspaper also begins with the letter n so let's review the pictures that we have we have letter n the sound of n is n for night time for necklace and also for newspaper now, let's see what the next letter is gonna be. It's the letter O. Around and around we go. That's the way to make an O. So, it's just like a circle. So, we just start at the top. We make a curve. Go down. All the way up. And we close. So, let's practice writing that again. I want you to write also on your whiteboards. Go down up and stop one more we go down make a curve go up and we close we have the letter o capital letter o and let's see what the pictures that begin with the letter o so we have o is for otter o is for olive and o is for ostrich the other pictures, dolphin begins with the letter D, hmm, lamp begins with the letter L, and kettle begins with the letter K. So we have O, the sound of O is O for otter, olive, and ostrich. Now, no, 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 now we have our letter P, capital letter P. Straight line down, then pick it up off the ground. Add a half circle, nice and round. Let's try that. Start at the top, we make a straight line down. We go back up, we make a curve and close. Let's do that one more time. Straight line down. Go back to the top and we make a curve. One more. Straight line down. Go back to the top and we make a curve. And we have what letter? Letter P. Capital letter P. What are the things that begin with the letter P? We have P is for ant. Nope, that's letter A. Where's letter A? A is uh, there. P is for pumpkin. Yes, it is. 
P is for elephant. No, that's letter E. P is for penguin. Yep. P is also for pizza. Newspaper, that's letter N. That was the letter last time. So we have letter P, P, P for penguin. Uh, sorry, pumpkin, I mean. Sorry, sorry. Pumpkin, penguin, and pizza. Let's do that again. P is for pumpkin, penguin, and pizza. Done with the letter M, N, O, P. Let's proceed to the letter Q. Capital letter Q. Round Q is a quarter to spend. Add a, line, a little line when you're at the end. So it's just like making letter O but then with a slanting line in the bottom. Okay? So let's try. Start at the top. We go make a curve. Go all the way up. And stop. And then let's make a slanting line here in the bottom. Practice on your whiteboard markers. Uh, whiteboards, I mean, sorry, with your whiteboard markers. Start at the top. We make a curve. Go all the way up. And a line down. Okay? Start at the top. We go make a curve. Go all the way up. Stop. And we make a slanting line down. We have letter Q. Letter Q. And what are the things that begin with the letter Q? Q is for, this is the queen. The queen is the partner of the king. We also have, oh no, what happened to my star? My star doesn't want to stay there, okay? Let's just put that star there. That's uh, Q is for queen. Hippo. Hippo, that's letter H. And then this one, this is a fence. So that's letter F. And then this is a penguin. That's letter P. This one. That's quiet. Quiet begins with the letter Q also. And the last one that we have is a quilt. So let's cover it with stars because teacher Sari doesn't have star sticker anymore. So let's just use this one. Okay? So we have our letter Q and the sound of Q is qu qu for queen, quiet, and quilt. Letter Q after Q, we have the letter R and the sound of R is R, R. First draw a line, then add a rainbow and then a rainbow, add a ramp and you're ready to go. So that's how we write capital letter R. We start at the top, we make a straight line down and then we make a curve just like the rainbow and then we make a ramp going down. That's a slanting line. Let's practice again. Straight line down, we go back to the top, we make a curve. And we make a slanting line down. So like we kick. Okay? Let's do that one. Straight line down. Go back to the top. We make a curve. And we kick. Okay? We kick like, like that. So we make our slanting line for our letter R. The sound of R is R. -er, just like for... Hmm. Oopsies. Sorry about that. R is for ring. R for raccoon and R for rocket. Because the other pictures, just like quilt, is for letter Q. This one, horn, is for letter H. And duck is for letter D. So we only have ring, raccoon, and the rocket that begins with the letter R. And now for the last letter for today, we have the letter S. And the sound of S is Curvy S is easy to make. Start at the top and make a stick. So we start at the top. We make a curve. Slanting line down. We curve up and stop. Okay? Let's practice again. We make a curve. Make a slanting line down. Curve up and stop. One more. Make a curve. Slanting line down. And we curve up. Now we have the letter S. And the sound of S is S, just like the snake. And S is also for sandwich, S, sandwich, S, S, sun, and S, S, socks. 
all of these pictures that I covered begin with the letter S. But for alligator, that's the letter A. For volcano, that's letter V. And for zoo, that's the letter Z. So only the things that begin with the letter S is our sandwich, sun, and socks. Did you listen to our letters and how to write them? And also the pictures that begin with the letter S? Okie dokie, it's time for you to work. So you have to trace, write, and try your letters M to the letter S. And afterwards, you also have to sort the correct beginning sounds. Okay? Do your best when you're working. You can now pause the video. All right, we're already done, almost finished. Now let's have our color words. So let's read, this is red. Let's spell it out, R-E-D, the word is red. So I will encircle the pictures that are color red. So we have a red fire truck and a red heart there. Next one, we have G-R-E-E-N. Hmm, that's not gray. That is the word green. Very good. This is the word, what again? The color word green. Just like our frog and the tree, they are all color green. Now we have B. L U E that reads black. Nope. Hmm. B L U E brown. Hmm. No. B L U E is blue. This word again is the word blue. Just like our blueberries. And the sky is color blue. Now, what do we have here? Y E L L O W yellow is that yellow? Yellow. Yes, it is. It's the word yellow. Color word yellow, just like our chick and our bus, it's color yellow. Let's read our words again. We have red, green, blue, and Yellow. Now, let's proceed to the other color words that we have. Okay, here, Teacher Sarah's favorite color. P-U-R-P-L-E. That reads purple. Purple, purple, purple. Just like the purple jam and the purple eggplant. They are all purple. Now, here, this one. B R O W N, bur bur, bur burlock, nope, burlu, nope. This is brown. Can we say that again? Brown, brown like our tree trunk and brown like the shoe. Bur brown. Okay, here O R A N G E. O, orange. Let's read that one more time. Orange. Orange, just like our juice and the fish, is color orange. And this one, your favorite colors, especially Maggie Mix. P-I-N-K, that is pink. Let's read that one again. Pink. Pink like the ballerina's shoes. And pink like cotton candy. So we already answered, answered, I mean all of them. So let's read them one more time before we go to the next slide. We have the word purple, brown, orange, and the word pink. Now let's proceed to the last slide for this one. So we have this one. This is G R. A Y that reads 
Gray. Yes, not green. This is gray. G-R-A-Y. Gray. Just like the fork and the trash can. Its color, gray. And we also have the color word W. H-I-T-E. That reads white. Very nice. White. White like our envelope and white like the tooth. It is color white. And the last color that we have is B-L-A-C-K. That reads black. Very nice. B-L-A-C-K is black. Black like our spider. And also the tires. So they are color black. So let's read our color words again. We have the word gray white and black very nice now let's matchy match matchy match okay let's read remember r e d reads red so let's draw a line to the red paint b l u e reads blue so let's draw a line to the color blue this one y e l l o w is Yellow. Here we go. G R E E N. That is green. So up it goes. All done with this one. Let's go to the next slide. Oh no. Okay, here. This is O R A N G E. That is orange. So let's draw a line. Next one. P-U-R-P-L-E. Pink. No, purple. Let's draw a line to color purple. Next one, P-I-N-K. Purple. No, pink. P-I-N-K, pink. This is pink. And last one for this slide, B-R-O-W-N. Brown. Not black, not blue. Brown. And, and the last one, the last one that we have, this one, this one, B-L-A-C-K, that is black. Let's draw a line. Then we have G-R-A-Y, gr, gray, gray is here. And the last one, W-H-I-T-E, that is white. All answered. Very nice. Now it's your turn, your turn. So you have to do your color word worksheets. So here you have to write, find, and build your color word. Next one you have to, what do you call this? You have to read the sight words or the color words so you will know what color you will use for your son and lastly you have to encircle all of the pictures that show the color that you have on top so just like this one here it says red so you only have to encircle the pictures that show red so do good with your work, finish everything today, and I will see you not on Wednesday. That's a mistake again. I will see you all on Friday. Friday, Friday is gonna be the last day of our review. So you should not be absent, okay? Bye-bye everyone. Thank you for listening and working with teacher. Bye-bye.